Hey, Krista Lindstrom here from Krista's Mortgage Minute. Hey, so I get the pleasure every single week to uh, pick up and drop off my son and his friend from the airport. They both work up north in Fort McMurray. And I find this time in the car every Wednesday super entertaining because they ask me fantastic questions about wanting to buy a house. So Hayden said to me today, hey, Krista, how much down payment do I need in order to be able to buy a house? And I'm like, well, Hayden, that's actually a loaded question. And that's an excellent topic for Krista's Mortgage Minute. So Hayden, this is for you. You need a minimum of 5% down payment in order to be able to purchase a home, uh, an owner-occupied home. Uh, but there's that's the basic easy answer. This answer gets more complex. If you are looking to avoid any CMHC premiums, you are required to have 20% down. So the CMHC premium starts with 5% down and then it decreases at 10% down, 15% down, and it goes away at 20% down. So if you are looking to um, save 20% down, it will save you the default insurance fee. I say CMHC as a default for the three insurers that we have in Canada, Canada Guarantee, Sagan, and CMHC, they're all the same. They're default insured. But 20% down is what avoids the insurance premium. But there's an extra category that a lot of people don't know about. It's the secret sauce to lending um, that is not available at your traditional financial institution. So this status called insurable status um, and you can get a much better interest rate if you have 35% down. And I know that's a lot of money, but did you know that your interest rate drops significantly if you have 35% down payment instead of 20% down payment? So there's this extra notch up that can save you a significant amount of money if you have some additional funds available that you can allocate towards down payment. This is the one of the things that we look for um, at Mortgage Simple. If you do have a significant of a down payment, we will say, hey, what are the chances you can top this up? Because you can probably save a significant amount of money if you can do so. So loaded answer to your question, Hayden. Keep your questions coming. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Have a great week.